What's up, y'all? <clears throat> Winston Bennett here, Bodacious Faith, Part 3. Let me ask you this question. What happens when what you pray for does not come to fruition? Let me give you a for instance. When my teammate Cedric Dink, uh, Jenkins was in the hospital, and I was not there, but I'm sure his mother and his wife possibly were, and I'm sure they were praying with everything that was within them that God would heal him. Ultimately, Cedric passed. Is God less of a God because Cedric is not here with us now in bodily form? What am I saying? I've been talking to you about bodacious faith. Your faith must go through to the end. But in spite of your faith, we serve a sovereign God who knows the end from the beginning. We don't know the end from the beginning. We're made by him. We come from the dirt. We come from the dust. And from the dust, we shall go back. We, we're reliant on the sovereign God and whatever his purpose and plan is for our life. So while we may get distraught with God because we don't know the whole plan, he may, maybe he's not revealed it to us as of yet. What he tells us to do is just believe, just believe. Let him do the rest. One man watereth, one man planteth. It's God that brings the increase. So if after you've had all the faith that you can muster and the circumstance doesn't change, then you know it wasn't in God's sovereign will to change that situation. Oh, I know what you're saying. He's God. He's God. All things are possible. He can do anything. All oh, that's true. But he's also sovereign. He's also all powerful. Sovereign meaning he can do what he wants, when he wants. He's God. He's the Almighty. So keep that in mind, even as we have bodacious faith, even as we have things that we're hoping for, we're praying for, we're looking for situations to change, we're looking for our healing of our loved ones, we're looking for loved ones to come out of prison, you know, we're looking for people to get jobs that has been looking for jobs for months and maybe even for years. For those who are single that are looking to get married, we're praying for all that. And we believe God is going to make that happen. But if he don't, he's still God. Peace.